Hello there, today I'm going to talk about how to integrate ChatGPT with IntelliJ, another ID like Visual Studio Code. So before that, we need to make sure that you have the latest version of IntelliJ. To get the latest version, you need to go to this IntelliJ and click on About IntelliJ Idea. So once you click on that, you'll find here the version number. Otherwise, you'll not be able to download the latest ChatGPT plugin. So make sure you have the latest one. The next step is you're going to install the ChatGPT plugin. So if you're new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon for the notification. You need to go to IntelliJ, then click on this preferences, then go to plugin here, then go to the marketplace, then search for here, chart GPT tool. So you could see this is the first plugin which you're going to install. So click on install button here, click on that. It got installed, click on OK. So now you could see the chat GPT is installed successfully. The icon is here. Now once you click on this and once you log in, you will have this screen. To log into the chat GPT, you need to have an OpenAI account. So don't worry if you don't have the account. We have an existing video. I'll put a link in the description for a sign up and login. So once you log in, you could see like this screen. Then after that, a couple of uh, settings you could do it. Suppose now it's the right hand side. If you want to keep into the left hand side, you can move into different position. You could see the top left, click on top left this side so I don't keep it here move into the, the position where it was there so move to top right top the Java program to verify if a given string is a palindrome or not so let's run it cool now you could see it's given a program is Java program which is a to verify once you enter a string and uh, you can verify whether this string is palindrome or not so it's given the explanation of this so let's copy this program and try to execute in IntelliJ if it works so I'll copy this one so I'll create a new Java class I'll give name as a palindrome copy this code so I'll minimize the chat GPT plugin, then I'll paste the code it here. So I pasted the code which I got it from here. You could see I copy the code from here. You can copy from here. Click on this copy code button. It will copy and paste it here. So I copy the code, but there is a problem because I given the class name is palindrome, but here name is palindrome checker. So I need to change this name. So go here, right click, refactor, rename the file and checker. Click on refactor. Now error is gone. So I need to execute this program now. To execute the Java program in IntelliJ, the syntax is control shift r so i'll press this control shift r so now you could see it's building and it's going to execute the program so it's asking to enter a string to verify the palindrome so if i enter a madam m-a-d-a-m because if you read left to right right to left both side is equal so it's a palindrome so if i enter so you say madam is a palindrome so if i execute one more time and if i give the enter the string little tech pro little tech pro so it's not a palindrome number that's great so that's how you can do many things about any type of program you can write from the chat gpt and you could utilize this uh, IntelliJ to execute your program like uh, pretty much anything like python java c c plus plus any type of program you could do it so hopefully this video is helpful for you to integrate IntelliJ and chat gpt and keep learning and keep watching little tech pro thank you if this video is useful to you, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. There is a long way to go. Keep learning. Thank you. Namaste.